All of us know someone consumed with anger and resentment. We might even be that person. It turns out these feelings have negative health consequences. Who of us has not been hurt by the actions or words of someone else? Criticism from a family member or a coworker, someone taking credit for your work or spreading rumors is always hurtful. Sometimes hurts go deeper than that and it's easier for those feelings to swallow up who we want to be. Long lasting feelings of anger and bitterness can cost you dearly. Depression, anxiety, sleep problems, stress, and high blood pressure are consequences of holding grudges. Gagija in Ojibwe means to appease, apologize to, show respect to. Gagi is a tagazi means to forgive. It means to decide to let go of feelings of resentment and thoughts of revenge. It does not necessarily mean reconciliation, and whoever hurt you might not want to have this discussion. If you're in an abusive relationship, your healthcare provider can help you, but only if you tell them. Gagi Zatagazi, forgiveness, means you can move on with peace, joy, and hope. It allows you to live in gratitude for the gifts you have. Gagi Zatagazi improves your physical, emotional, mental, and spiritual well being. It can even lead to compassion and empathy for the one who put you here. Sometimes the one you need to forgive is yourself. Forgiveness doesn't always change the one who hurt you, but it will always change you. If you've hurt someone, be the first to apologize without any excuses. You both deserve to live lives free from this burden. As always, remember to call an elder. They've been waiting for your call. I'm Dr. Arnie Vineo, and this is Health Matters. Mm -hmm.